Cops, central organization of police specialists. Fighting crime in a future time. Protecting Empire City from Big Boss and his gang of crooks. of the baby bad guy. Cops file 21813. There's an old saying, good things come in small packages. Well, sometimes bad things come in small packages too. We learned that lesson the hard way on one of our toughest jewel robbery cases ever. Here's how the caper came down. Leprechaun and his bag of diamonds. Cut the corn, wise guy. <laughs> All right, my friend. You and I are going to take a trip down to the station. I've got a small jail cell I want you to try on for size. Oh, huh? yeah, Flatfoot. Well, try this on for size. Oh! <laughs> It's a little police business. I guess being small has some advantages, but so does having power cops. <laughs> that was a big mistake, big guy. Boy! 
donuts. But you can't let the little things get you down. It's my fault that that half-pint hood is still on the streets. We all have our bad days, Longarm. You'll bring Small Guy to justice. I'm beginning to think that's a pretty tall job. I've been watching you, Small Guy. I like what I've seen. That's fine, Big Boss. But what's this about a deal? Well, I want you to go to work for me, see? Yeah, we could do big things together. What's in it for me? Well, I'll give you two pennies out of every dollar you steal. I thought you might say that. Say hello to my gang. I'm Snubnose. And I'm sawed off. If there's one thing me and the boys don't like, it's to be short-changed, say. <laughs> All right, small guy. I'll cut you and your gang in for a more sizable share. Ah, we'll I'll have to find you a proper hideout. Eh, yeah, leave that to me, big boss. I've got the perfect setup in mind. It's called Mrs. Lopsided's Orphanage. Cigars! Coochie, coochie, oh! Oh! Naughty, naughty, naughty! First, Mrs. Lopsided's going to give you a baby bath and change your diapers. Then she's going to put you all in the pen. Nobody's putting me in the pen! Me neither. Oops! The playpen! Now shut up! The old broad will hear ya. Tonight we're breaking out of here to pull our first job, see? Till then, you two better rock like babies. Go, 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 go. You're such good little children. I know you'll make Mrs. Lopsided proud. She's gonna wake. This bottle's holding more fireworks than the 4th of July. <laughs> ah, look at 
Look at all these jewels. I'm going to be rich. I'm going to be big. Eh, stop your blabbing and start your bagging. We got to get back to the orphanage for our 8 o'clock feeding. Long arm, I'm afraid there's been another jewel robbery. And it's definitely the work of Small Guy. I suppose Whitney Morgan and her camera crew will be showing up to rub it in. Right. I can't understand why she isn't here. But why do you want to film a documentary on me? To tell you the truth, Mrs. Lopsided, I'm a little tired of doing crime reports. I think you and your orphanage would make a wonderful human interest story. Oh, my heavens! How exciting! I'll help you in any way I can. Hmm, what strange-looking little babies. You ain't exactly sleeping beauty, lady. <clears throat> oh, look! Ella's the elephant! I haven't seen one of these in years. <gasps> I used to have one just like it when I was a kid. Oh, I have to hear it talk. Hey! to be hiding. Okay, you two, reach for it. Small guy? That's right, sister. Me and my boys are taking over this nursery. You're our prisoners. And I was tired of doing crime stories. You'd better let us go, small guy, or you're going to have the cops to deal with. I ain't worried, sister. When it comes to coppers, the small guy doesn't play patty cake. You're a naughty little boy. Naughty, naughty, naughty. These aren't children, Mrs. Lopsided. They're dangerous criminals. Oh, fiddle faddle. All they need is a good dose of castor oil. Small Guy and his gang have been robbing jewelry stores all over Empire City. Now they've kidnapped Whitney Morgan and are demanding a ransom for her return. Those little guys are smart. They never leave a clue. They're bound to make one little mistake. And when they do, we'll cut them down to size. before the cops arrive. Looks like they accidentally set off the alarm and had to leave in a hurry. Now they still managed to empty out the vault. Yeah, and no sign of a clue. Wait a minute. I think we've got something here. 
A baby rattle? What could that mean? Mrs. Lopsided's orphanage. Mrs. Lopsided's orphanage? I recognize this rattle. It's one of Mrs. Lopsided's. We do a fundraiser there every year. He's right. Longarm, I want you and Bullseye to check it out. If small guy and his gang are in there, we better be careful. Activate sound microphones and heat sensors. Nice, nice, nice! Is it, is it, What do you two dry babies knock it off? Bingo! We found them, Bulletproof. They're hiding out the orphanage. Setting down. Good work, long arm. We're on our way. It's crime fighting time! Small guy, we know you're in there. It's the cops. <laughs> We gotta make a break for it. Looks like you junior jailbirds finally learned your lesson. Get us out of here, copper! We're stuck! <laughs> 
Get used to it, small guy. You'll be doing some big time. Once again, the elite cops law enforcement team has restored order to Empire City. My own special thanks goes to Officer Longarm, whose heroic action led to the rescue of Mrs. Lopsided and myself, and to the arrest of the mini mobsters. Nice going, Officer. To make a long story short, the stolen money was returned to the banks, and Small Guy and his gang were sent to the pen. Only this time, it wasn't the play pen, it was the state pen. <laughs> <laughs> Cops file 21813, the case of the baby bad guy. Case closed. Cops, roll call. Highway, mainframe, long arm, Bowser and Blitz, sundown, hardtop, mirage, bullseye, mace, barricade, and they call me Bulletproof. These are Empire City's most wanted crooks. Berserko. Rock Crusher. Misdemeanor. Turbo Two-Tone. Dr. Bad Vibes. Nightshade. Use caution in apprehending. <laughs>